A business owner speaks out after violence breaks out in his parking lot. Yeah, one man was shot to death. Another is in the hospital in critical condition. Sloan Heller is live in front of Chubby's Diner at 37th and Broadway in Midtown with more on that. Good morning, Sloan. Good morning. You know, Chubby's is a very popular diner. It's a family business. It's been around for about 20 years. And uh, we talked to uh, one of the two brothers that owns this location just a little while ago. Of course, uh, he's still trying to piece together what happened. Police really don't know, or they're at least not releasing the motive, whether this was a robbery gone wrong or something else. But uh, what he told us, he got a call from police about 2.45 this morning. He was told that one man had been shot to death in the parking lot right behind his diner. Another man was critically injured and then actually ran into his restaurant for help. Now, the owner says the victims were actually caught on tape earlier in the night, about 10 o'clock. They were eating dinner at his diner, and what he believes is that they left, came back, and then met up with a group of people seen driving a white Cadillac. Again, shortly after uh, those two groups met up, witnesses heard several gunshots, again, all coming from the back of Chubby's diner, and that is when, again, one person killed, another critically injured. Uh, there were about 12 people, by the way, inside Chubby's Diner when all of this was going on. They were uh, forced to stay inside for hours while police checked the crime scene. For something like this to happen, it's definitely going to take a step backwards initially, but I think eventually uh, time will pass and hopefully we can just weather the storm and let everybody know that, you know, we, we do our best to, uh, to make sure that this is a safe environment. Now, the owner tells us that he installed several surveillance cameras inside and out. He has floodlights as well as security on the weekend, so he really feels like he did all he could to protect this diner. Unfortunately, everything he did uh, did not stop these crimes from happening early this morning. At this point, again, we're waiting for a motive and also some suspect information to pass along. As soon as we have that, we'll bring that to you. For now, live in Midtown, Sloan Heller, NBC Action News.